Yeah, yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, time. What you say? Yeah, yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, time. Okay, yeah, yeah, time. Hey, my peeps. Well, welcome to the show. How you guys doing? Hope everybody's doing well. Let me make a little bit of adjustment here. Okay. How y'all doing? It's good to see each and every one of you. Um, let's get our prayer in, and then we're going to tell you what we're eating on today, and then we got some chit-chatting to do. Okay? Right. Bye, yes, Okay. Amen. Amen. Hey, y'all. So, what's cracking? What's popping? Uh, I have over here some Spanish, some Spanish, some spinach, a little bit of uh, red onions, and a pepper. I fried up some chicken wings, and I got some macaroni and cheese over here. And he's gonna be eating on some macaroni and cheese. And I got my HTO because I don't too. have a jug yet. I got my trusty red hot sauce and, and I got some ranch too. I have my blue cheese, y'all know I like, in my H to the O. So that's what we will be having today. So happy Tuesday. Yep. Jesus. Today's too happy yes. Tuesday, you guys. We're so happy to be mm -hmm. with you. Um, so yeah, let's get some bites in and then we'll do a little chit-chatting about what we've been doing the last few days. And uh, yeah. You going to give the positive quote early on? Or you gonna I will. Let me get a little food in me. Mm -hmm. I steam this spinach right quick while I put it in the microwave. Mm. That's good. Piece That's a little bit of... Right there for you, y'all. Nice little golden piece of chicken she cooked up. Pepper, a little olive oil on it. Could you pass it hot sauce, please? Mm-hmm. Mm. Gotta get another bottle. I've had that bottle for I don't know how long. It's getting used now. Get your Popeye. Is it Popeye? And olive oil? You have to spin it? You dip. Mmm. With Brutus in the background. <laughs> Brutus in the background. Brutus is trying to get with olive oil. Take olive oil from Popeye. Mm hmm. Mmm. So, hope you guys had a good weekend. Hope you had a good Christmas, too. Yeah, let's see. Have we been back since then? Mm. We did the live... Uh, well, we tried to. Cooking breakfast. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. So that was on Saturday, and a lot of you joined us live. We had fun with that, and I noticed that a lot of you uh, saw the um, video after the live. So thank you so much for that. That was on um, Saturday. Mm -hmm. And then we had another live that we did on Friday. We went to the beach. So if you haven't seen that video, go check out that video. We had fun. It's just nice being out there at the, at the ocean. Then we did the light. We tried to go live with the light. Okay, so yeah, that's what I want to explain. So then Sunday, we wanted to share with you guys the night of lights here in St. Augustine downtown, how they decorate every year. And everything is all lit up and it's all pretty and all that. And we wanted to go live, but what was the deal? Why it kept cutting off on us? I'm, some of you, I know you um, tried to access the video um, or the live. The connection. Yeah. We couldn't, the cell service where we're at wasn't, good, wasn't a good connection. So we had to record it. So we recorded. And that video is out there. So go take a look at that. We had a nice time that night. It was packed out there. We had our mask on and everything. And quite a few people did. Of course, there were people that didn't. But um, yeah, we had a nice time. Sunday? Mm -hmm. That was Sunday evening. So go check that video out for us. Give it a thumbs up. It's 
So that's what I wanted to explain. If you saw the was trying to go live and it didn't work out or whatever, that was what was that's what happened. So make sure you have your post notifications on because I will be going live on New Year's Eve. I will be at work on New Year's Eve. Tim got work. So the party will be you and me. And depending on how busy I be at work, I'll be tapped in. So I'll be talking through the chat. Mm -hmm. I have a little time. I don't know why they got y'all working on New Year's Eve. It's all about that dollar. I don't know. Mm. So how are the wings that I cook? You cook them good, baby. You cook them good. Can I get a paper towel? Mm-hmm. Cook them up real good. Okay. Almost like crunchy chicken a little bit. <laughs> I don't think they like crunchy chicken, but... Every now and then I want some, I didn't do them in the air fryer, I just fried them. Every now and then I want some fried chicken. But yeah, so, we've been moving and shaking these last mm -hmm. few days. It was nice having hubby at home. And congratulations <clears throat> to all of the... NFL teams that made the playoffs. Hmm. Like I said, my team is an ICU. Waiting on somebody to come visit me. But congratulations to all of you. Looking forward to seeing some good games. It's playoff time now. So that's going to be fun to watch and see what the Cowboys do. I heard something when I was passing the TV. Somebody talking about the Cowboys, so... Mm -hmm. Their name is really getting thrown around this year, mm -hmm. this season. So, mm -hmm. let's see what happens. But, yeah. And while we're talking about the Seahawks in Seattle, let's jump over to the weather. Mm -hmm. They are in a snowstorm. Most definitely. And got a, that happened over the weekend. And then another one's coming down. And they got another one that's coming down from Canada. Mm hmm From Vancouver. And the ones that come from that way, oh, those are the ones that be it's cold. Cold and sock a punch to you. So we had some family members send pictures and stuff. So yeah. They snowed down. They shut in. If you didn't go out to the store and get what you needed. I think you may be walking to it. That's all I was going to say. You pit a pat into the store. Mm -hmm. We've had that. Well, I didn't pit a pat, but. Yeah, she didn't have to pit a pat nowhere. <laughs> I'm the one that pit a pat into the stove and pushing a shopping cart in the stove, in the snow. Y'all know how difficult that is. But why you fill the shopping cart? Because I had too many bags to carry. No, you didn't. Yeah, no. I did. You didn't have to walk to no store. Yeah, Because we always had SUVs, so you drove. Oh, yeah. You, now, no, the, the no, one time no. you walked down to the Circle K, mm -mm. which... No. Uh, when we was uh, living um, downtown Renton and on Williams. Oh, you had to walk the Safeway? You and Philip walked the Safeway? No, Philip didn't go. I don't think I made him go no, with you so go. he could experience. Nope, he didn't go. Oh. You know who walked with me? Mom? No. Jerry? Yeah, it was me and Jerry. Well, he wasn't but a, a little tight. Yeah, he was a little tight. Slowed me down. Had to pick him up every now and then. Oh, yeah, that's right. Too. And things and stuff. And when we got that's to... That's the grandson. But he was always in your butt, so hey. When we yep. got to Safeway and things, got the shopping cart, he got in it. And we did our grocery shopping and got to the checkout line. Paid for everything and all the bags excuse me, was inside the shopping cart and he was inside the shopping cart and I'm like, there's no way I'm going to be able to carry all this and then he's going to want me to carry him because his little leg has gotten too tired from walking in the snow. Ooh, that pepper. Ooh, jalapeno. 
So um, I pushed him in the groceries, in the shopping cart, in the snow. I was pushing the cart, then I was pulling the cart, I was pushing the cart, then I was pulling the cart, all the way to the house, to the front steps. I kind of, okay, I sort of remember. It's been things. a while. And then uh, I opened the door and said, I need some help with the bags and stuff. And then you're like, where'd Jerry at? And then you came to the door and looked and he's sitting in the shopping cart. Hey, y'all, y'all. With some type of candy or whatever in his hands, all bundled up. Oh, well, yeah, you know I have my baby bundled up. Looking like a snow bunny. Mm-hmm. But it's fun in the snow. It is fun. Mm -hmm. If you don't have to go nowhere, you're not trying to make it to work. You know, or whatever. And see, in Washington, you know, those are, we got mountains and hills and everything. So, they shut down real quick. Things close up real quick. If it starts snowing, it's going to shut down. Schools, churches, everything. Buses Stores, be, buses, buses, everything. Buses ain't shutting down. They just going to be on snow route. Unless it's one of them real bad ones like it was in the early 90s before I had met you that I told you I got mm -hmm. caught up in. Mm -hmm. Buses was on snow Trying routes. Trying to get home from work and got stuck downtown. Buses was on snow routes. It took nine hours to get um, for a really a 30 minute drive for me to get to downtown. And once I got downtown, the buses deal. had all shut down. There was no hotels. All the rooms had been taken. You had to stand in line to use the pay phone before we had a cell phone. And I stood in line and finally I got a hold of the family. And it was after 4 o'clock in the morning before they got on the road and my brother-in-law I probably told you about in another video that passed away a month ago. Him and my mom came and drove all the way. It took them hours to get to downtown and they came and got me. That's because I had called on the phone and I was like, I had went to this hotel and they were giving blankets and stuff and they said if you can't, you know, get home. You know, they was giving out blankets and little snacks and water and stuff. You could sleep there in the lobby. And there was this little old lady that was there, and her son came and picked her up. Man, I went over to the phone and called my mom. I was crying on the phone. I was like, the last lady, her son came and picked her up. And then that's when my mom told my brother-in-law, Rob, he was like, we got to go get her. And they trudged on, and I-5, that's the, one of the main highways. Shut down. Cars all Cars. The we, we was just weaving in and out of cars. Everything shut down. Semis. No, it was desolate. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I remember that. You remember? Mm -hmm. That had to be, that was way before Philip. so that was late 80s, early 90s. That was 92 to be exact. I don't know if it was. Mm -hmm. Was it? Yep. It's 92, either 92 or 93, one of them years. No, it had to be, it was earlier because I wasn't even thinking about getting married or and I had Philip in ninety four. was born in ninety four. Well then it was ninety three then. No, I'm saying earlier. Oh earlier? Mm. Oh you're talking about the snowstorm that that was the eighty uh nine storm. Mm, that's, yeah, yeah. That's that more like nine storm. Mm -hmm. And then we had the ninety five storm. That's when Philip was born. This chicken is bomb, y'all. Y'all y'all was on the And then we had the um when we was living um in the apartment on Will, uh, off of uh, Williams and Burnett, we had that storm was like 2005, I think, or 2006 storm. And then we had the storm when we was up there at Brandon's house that shut it down, didn't have no power for a whole week. <laughs> More than a week. Mm -hmm. mm. And things, so snowstorms come through there, and when they do, you better be prepared. Mm-hmm. Because it's going to sock it to you. Sock it to you, mama. But it was. Was it? Mm-hmm. Okay, let me get my... Oh, I done lost the thing. Let me get my... Uh, oh, there it is. Motivational thought of the day in with you guys. 
This one says, now listen up. If you can't fly, then run. If you can't run, then walk. If you can't walk, then crawl. But by all means, keep moving. Who do you think that's about? Put it down in the comments. Let me know. Martin Luther King Jr. I love that one. Mm -hmm. I sure enough do too. That's a nice so, one. So, so that's telling you what? Just, you know, you got to take steps. Mm -hmm. Wherever mm -hmm. you are, that's okay. Mm -hmm. But keep moving, whatever you do. For sure. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> don't give up mm -mm. and don't stop. Mm -mm. Keep going forward. Because mm -hmm. reverse is broke. Mm -mm. Don't want to go backwards. Sometimes we get a little backslide in us. That's because mm -hmm. we all imperfect. But mm -hmm. when you recognize that, keep moving and keep moving forward. Okay. So everybody done got through Christmas and everything. Now what y'all doing? Everybody getting ready for 2022? It's knocking on the door in a few days. Yep. I cannot believe it. I really cannot believe it. 2022. I remember when 20, uh, 2000 was coming in and Y2K and everybody thinking computers are not going to, they're going to shut down like, and couldn't get no money out the ATMs and things and stuff. Remember? Yeah, everybody thought. We shut everything down that night. Mm -hmm. I got stuff on my face. And Please. things and stuff and had everybody scared that turning their computers off and all this mm -hmm. it's zeros and ones it's gonna calculate and I tell I told Carla I said Carla this is zeros and ones it's gonna calculate it's gonna keep going who's talking about, I, I don't get that binary very good but mm -hmm. but we still did I shut everything down and uh I think we took some money out Mm -hmm. Just in case, so we make sure we had money on us. And woke up the next day, and it was the same old Sunday same. Morning. I told you, I said it's gonna be the same thing when you wake up in the morning. You'll be able to go to the stove, to the bank machine, and do whatever. But but I do understand because I was on the technology side of the house for the company that I worked at at that time, and it was new. They didn't know how that number was gonna work. Switch it over like that. You know, from not four, really from a four digit to a five digit. What do you mean five digits? 1999 is four digits. And 2000 20. is five. No, it's not. It's four digits. Too. Oh, my bad. Four digits, y'all. Yeah, four digits, too. That I'm wasn't five. Yeah, no, it wasn't because of the digits. It was that. What do you call it? It was going from 99 to zero. Yeah. Basically. We don't know, but I mean, I think that that was yeah. it. So we yeah. just guessing, y'all. Just guessing. Yeah, so. Mm -hmm. And everything worked out just fine. Now we so now that was twenty-two years ago, y'all. Twenty-two years ago. Can you believe that? Twenty-two years ago. What was you doing twenty-two years ago? Twenty-two years ago. Sitting there looking at each other. Some of you was just born twenty-two years ago. Hmm. I know I'm still over here like that. Chicken came out good. Mm -hmm. It did. You, you fried it on up. Mm -hmm. Do it. Fried it on up. And just to let y'all know, she been taking her blood pressure like she's supposed to. And then her Fitbit helps her out too. That she got for Christmas. So. Courtesy of hubby. Trying to keep her on track, y'all. Yes, yes. But y'all, please that. don't forget to give her a like. Like the video. Hit the thumbs up, please. A share. And share it out. A subscribe. I most definitely. If you're new to the channel and you stopped in to see what's going on over here, why not? Hit that subscribe button. And make sure you hit your post notification. That way you'll be notified each and every time Yaya, that's me, upload videos for you. You heard Mm. And thank you very much. Yes, we appreciate it. So don't forget, when you get time, go out there, 
Check out the uh, Christmas Day Live where we cooked breakfast. We had so much fun. Sure enough did. Talked so much. Had so much fun with yeah. the peeps. Mm -hmm. Donna Green, Marty Mars, Diamond. Kiki. Kiki. Uh, all of y'all. <laughs> Madam <laughs> Soul Food. Had so much Antoinette. fun. Internet. Y'all, this is my, my nephew. Nevaeh, no, Nevaeh missed it. Uh, the live went on that one. Yeah. And then my nephew telling me to get close to the stove so my jersey could catch on fire because he with them boys. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. It was a fun day. Enjoyed yeah, every bit enjoy. of it. And the food was good. Mm-hmm. It was something about cooking with y'all. So did it taste good. That was one of the better breakfasts we've had. And then showing you around a little bit of the lake in the back. Mm hmm But that was a fun video. Fun live feed. Yeah. And looking forward to doing a lot of more fun live feeds with y'all. Mm-hmm. And things. So we're not going to hold y'all too long. Oh, wait, right quick. And Donna, hey, I figured out the camera. I mean, the phone. When I'm recording live, instead of it being portrait how to get it landscape so now it'll be landscape and so then the view looks better at least I like the view better landscape and you had mentioned it why was it so narrow anyway it took me a minute y'all know I'll be working on things so mm -hmm. got squirrels on the back patio back there <laughs> they looking for them peanuts I put out there you put some peanuts out there yeah well, don't do that. I told you not to do that for them squirrels to be creeping around. I like them squirrels. They some nice little squirrels. They'll come right up to you. Okay. Like I told my dad, I was talking to him one day, and I was like, these squirrels out here. And he was like, leave them squirrels alone. Well, I ain't bothering them. No, I didn't say you were. I'm <laughs> saying he, you and him on the same page about it. No, I'm be creeping up around my door. And things and stuff. Now, when you see them standing up looking in, you'll be like, uh, you got any peanuts, man? <laughs> <You're so stupid. laughs> That's what I'm talking about. You know how they, you know how them squirrels stand up, you know, looking with their hands paw like this right here, looking. You got any peanuts? <laughs> Remember the time we had a, our favorite dog, Molly? She was a husky. And so Tim called me one day. I think I was at work. He was home. And he was like, you won't believe what happened. He said he heard all of this squealing and stuff in the backyard. And he went out there and Molly had these squirrels hemmed up in a corner. Yeah, the squirrels? Mama squirrel and her baby. Yeah. Mama was getting ready to tear Molly up. Uh -huh. And that squirrel was squealing and stuff. Molly barking. What the heck is all that going on? What the heck is going on? What is she barking at? And then I open the door and I hear some loud squeal and stuff and things. I thought it was her. And then I runs around the back of the house. And she got a, she right there in attack mode and stuff. And this squirrel standing up like this right here and stuff. Doing, yes, this, mm -hmm. doing this here stuff at her and things and stuff. Because she wasn't close to a tree or nothing to get, you know, her kids, her babies and stuff to the, to the, uh, Cherry tree we had in the backyard. Molly had her pinned. And I had to call Molly to leave them dog on squirrels alone. That mama was protecting her babies. Yep. Yep. So anyway, we're going to get on out of here, y'all. Thank you for stopping in. We appreciate you. Love you. Don't forget to make sure your post notifications are set for New Year's Eve. But we'll be back tomorrow. But until then. It's Yaya's time. Yeah, yeah, time. What you say? Yeah, yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, time. Okay, yeah, yeah, time. Thank you, guys. You guys have a wonderful day. Stay safe. Make sure you wear your mask when you're out and about. Deuces. Yeah, yeah, time. Bye, y'all.